Cam hyping it up too much, man. He got to sit down somewhere, man. Man, I didn't like that, dude. Cam, man, Cam got to I didn't like that at all. I mean, he need to stop that, man. He, he talked about it. I don't even like Tom Brady that much, but he is still one of the greatest quarterbacks of all yeah, time. You that. can't do that. No, I ain't gonna answer. Let's go. I'm gonna turn this off as a man. Your fan, fans keep calling, man. I appreciate y'all coming. We, not, we, we call not, during we not the show. We're not taking calls during the show, people. You got to call before or after. You know what? When we get to 100 fans, we're going to start taking calls. We get to 100 viewers. Like, share, comment, but make sure you share this with some people. We get to 100, we're going to start going live. Yeah, because I know y'all got something to say to us. That's Bill. And that's Will. And today on the Bill and Will Show, we're going to talk, like, comment, subscribe below so we can get to 100 so we can talk to you people. No name. No name. My boy Jimmy Butler is in his hotel room dribbling right now, getting disturbing calls, you know. But uh, he got he had a, he got a, a new thing he wants to do. He instead of having a a slogan on the back of his jersey, he wants to have just no name. He wants to put out there, if I didn't play basketball, y'all wouldn't y'all wouldn't know who I am. I'd be just like any other any other black guy out there. So I'd be any other <laughs> on the street. Y'all need to go check out Jimmy Butler's story though. It's an amazing story. He got an amazing story for sure. And then, and then for him to be this humble, nah, I'm, I'm okay with Jimmy Butler. I don't, I don't have nothing bad to say about Jimmy Butler. Well, how do you feel about him not wanting to wear a name on his jersey? That's fine. Because we're going to have a whole bunch of stuff on the back of our jerseys. You know? So, do your thing. I think Jimmy Butler, man, is one of the guys in the NBA. And he might not be a superstar household name over and wherever, but I think people know when it comes to Jimmy Buckets, man, he's a man to be respected. He's a man's man. He's a guy that's gonna give 100% every time out. He's someone that needs to be respected and, and commands respect. Um, he's a hardworking guy. He's been hardworking his whole life. That's why he's in the position that he's in. That's right. He's probably the most um, overachieving athlete in the NBA right now just because of his mindset. Um, and I love the idea of him not having a name on the back of his jersey. Because um, if he didn't play basketball, he would definitely be one of us. He would be working on the um, Butler and Butler show or the Butler and somebody else show or probably uh, hot shotting or flipping houses or, or working at the local Dairy Queen or something like that because uh, – no, I don't. I don't think he would be doing that, to be honest. I think his work history, if he didn't play basketball, he'd be aspiring in something He'd else. be successful at whatever else he just sure. decided he wanted to because pursue. His, his mindset, of, yeah, his sure. mindset is on, on um, point, man. But I'm, I'm like what Gibson said, go look up his story, man. His story is amazing. Go read about him. He overcame so much, man, being, being from where he's from. He has an amazing team around him that keeps him humble. And uh, I love that he got to pick where he wanted to go. Um, last summer, man, and he picked Miami, which is a great place. It's a great fit for him. He's a dog, and uh, look out for the Miami, um, Miami Dolphins. So I'm gonna give they got, you. They got, they got, they got two on their roster this year. I'm gonna give you just. I'm gonna sure. give you just a tidbit of some of his story. I want you to go look it up for yourself. Don't get the story from me. Look it up for yourself. But Jimmy Butler was basically homeless, and he was staying with one of his white friends upstairs. His parents, the, his white friend's parents, didn't even know that Jimmy was there. So at nighttime, Jimmy would come over. And sneak in the house and then go upstairs and go to sleep but later on the people found out about it but man you got to check out his story man it's real and and the, the obstacles that he overcame to make it to the nba and for him to stay as humble as he is and I, man he got nothing but respect coming from me that's bill my name is bill you will and this is the bill and will show salute to jimmy Butler.